Hi, I'm the producer of the Mario Kart series, Hideki Kono. In Mario Kart 7, we had underwater racing and flying through the air via glider. This time, we wanted to add something entirely new. We're calling this new feature anti-gravity. The tires will now transform. When they do, Mario and Luigi will race on the walls and ceilings, which is something new that we haven't tried before. You may have heard about Mobius strips. You twist a strip of paper and paste the ends together so it forms a loop, and the front and back become connected. In this new Mario Kart game, there's a unique course that looks like a Mobius strip twisted into the number 8. For this game, since the distinctive Mobius loop course looks like the number 8, we said to ourselves, the last game was Mario Kart 7, Mario Kart 8 would be perfect as a title. You're able to use Miiverse to communicate with other Mario Kart players from around the world. This feature will allow you to host tournaments, set rules, and play with friends and others in the community. Up to a total of 12 carts can compete in a match in both local and internet modes. After the 12 cart match is over, the game can automatically create a 30 second highlight reel featuring key points during the match. I think you're going to love this. You can also share replay data on Miiverse so people can watch and talk about it. You can do this within Mario Kart 8 in a place we're calling Mario Kart TV. It's like a channel, and within this Mario Kart TV, you can watch all sorts of replay data. You can watch your replay data and bury yourself in regret by watching past losses. Or you can flaunt your victories to others. We're working on it now, so you can share all these kinds of replays with your friends. I think the real secret of Mario Kart is that it's a multiplayer communication tool. It's great seeing many people having fun communicating and competing with each other. We want to make Mario Kart 8 into a game where that experience is enhanced so people around the world can play together and have even more fun. Basically, the game will support all controllers like the games in the series did before. For example, the Wii Remote and Nunchuck, the Wii Wheel, and now, of course, the gamepad are all supported. You can play it in all sorts of ways that match the way you play. The game shifted from SD to HD, and we're very excited now that we can take full advantage of the resolution in HD. This time, I think the environment, the Mario Kart world, is coming out quite well, to a point where you can almost get a sense as if you're really there, breathing in the air. I think you'll have fun. We're always working hard to do it right, and this time, the game also supports 60 frames per second so it's feeling really good. We're now aiming to keep 60 frames per second during the two-player mode, so we're fine-tuning the system now. We're making Mario Kart 8 so that it's going to be the definitive Mario Kart, the grand culmination of the past Mario Kart games. So there are all sorts of features packed in, and it's turning out to be a Mario Kart that literally everyone can enjoy. I hope you'll all have fun playing, and please wait just a little bit longer until it is released.